We love when Kat Palmer is with us, and I am excited about this, learning about maybe new restaurants to go and try. Yes. Kat, you are talking about the places to put on the to-do list that are in... The Whoa. best of City Weekly issue, which y'all won. Let's just—I just want to mention that as well. Thank you. <laughs> that was a moment for us. I love it. I can't remember what page we're on because it's really thick, you guys. There's <laughs> lots of best ofs in here. But good thing Utah yes. is on one of the pages. And thank you so much. You're welcome. And so even though th this is not on the rack anymore, you can go online, find Best of City Weekly. And it doesn't matter if you're in a relationship or not, because I love dating myself and I love going out with friends. You can get to go food. So it's okay if you're single. So, but date nights, um, I love them. And sometimes it's hard to think, where do we want to eat tonight? Where do you want to eat? Where do you want to eat? Same place every time. Mm -hmm. right? right? It's hard to mix things up. And there's a new restaurant on town they won Best of, Franklin Avenue. It's amazing. Have y'all been there? No, no, but this is on my list. Mm -hmm. Okay, I, where is it located? And so it's it? hidden, and that's one of the reasons I want to talk about it. It's down a little alleyway, like by Bar X, and so it's totally hidden. It's kind of new American cuisine, and you have to get the sour cream ice cream, which sounds crazy and amazing, what? but it comes out in this like massive mound, and it's so impressive and so fun to eat. And they have a, a cauliflower steak, which sounds weird, but I swear to you, it's the best thing ever, and it comes out with pistachio butter. Oh, it's my goodness. It's amazing. And so lots of great, it's just new American cuisine, lots of What's great What's it things. called again? Franklin Avenue. Franklin Avenue in downtown mm -hmm. Salt Lake City. Yeah, it's, okay. it's amazing. And so I love that place, and they won Best New Restaurant, and I don't know, and that's, that's an image from there. That looks beautiful. It's amazing. And I don't know if it's a lot, a lot of people's radars right now. I don't feel like it is. And how often do we hear about new restaurants and mm -hmm. we think, I'm going to go there, and then you might forget or you go, what was that called? But uh, yeah, if you hop online. Just hop on there. All the winners are there. They're all there. And the cool thing is, too, I think for date nights, we don't have to do restaurants either. You could go grab a cookie at Ruby Snap, which they won for best cookie. Because you, they are the best. Um, let's Ruby be Snap honest. They insane. are the best. <laughs> but I love you have everything from best eggs Benedict to best quiche to best best breakfast sandwich to burritos, right. Dina, to best photogenic dish dishes, and that was Table X. Uh, and and they're my favorite. another favorite of yours. They are my favorite. I love them. And it, when it's warm, I like to be out in the garden. You can request a garden. And then also, we mixed it up last time, and did we requested the chef's table. And you can sit and watch your meal being prepared. You can interact with Chef Mike. It's kind of a really cool experience. And so I love Table X. It's kind of like having a Michelin experience. Very romantic, lovely. And they wow. accommodate everything if you're gluten-free vegetarian they accommodate everything at, at table X okay what do you have on your list for best seafood um, current definitely current but I also love their desserts they have a dessert there that is made with olive oil powder and let me tell you until you've had that in your mouth like it's Wait, olive oil powder correct it sounds so weird what? but I I promise you it is one of my favorite desserts that's it right there oh it is that looks amazing it, it looks is beautiful it is so delicious and it's weird and wonderful and I can't even I don't even know exactly what it is but it's creative and when you want to mix things up City Weekly has got you covered because you can just pick different things from there and um, Lake Effect you we we love Lake Effect mm -hmm. they there is a distillery in Amsterdam that has one of the best gins and let me tell you Lake Effect has it so you can find some of the weirdest hardest to find things at Lake Effect. So you say that is best liquor selection. Correct. And that's what they won. They won for best liquor selection. And they have some of the hardest to find things. And it's fun to go for brunch on Mother's Day because it's not very busy on Mother's Day. They have live music I there. I love the live music. They have live that's, music. That's my favorite at Lake yeah. Effect. They have live music there. It's a great ambiance. You know, sh I love a place that has a good chandelier. I do too. Right? Not just one, but several. Right. <laughs> I love a place with a good chandelier. <laughs> and so, yeah, so you can't go wrong. And then Copper Onion, I'll tell you a little secret. I tried my first hamburger at age 32. Wait, what? and was it from Copper Onion? <laughs> and it was from Copper Onion. <laughs> and it was the best thing. I was like, what have I been missing life my whole life? I love that you just went top of the line right off the bat. Now well, it you ruined, can't, go, you it, can't it, go anywhere else. It now. ruined That's everything it. for me. After that, I was like, what was I doing? I should have stopped. Look, I should have like started down here. Over, it's um, so tall. That's copper onion. you have to cut it? How do you um, even yeah, you bite can't, into that? Your mouth isn't that big. You have to use a fork and knife. <laughs> Wait, so were you vegetarian? I was. You had that? Yeah, I was a lifelong vegetarian. And so copper onion, that was a bison burger. It is the best thing you'll ever have in your mouth. Like, 
like it's it so looks good. Like so wait, how did you? They talk you into it once you're there. You're vegetarian. Well, you just, I had I had made the choice before going there. You, okay. I just I just knew like if I was gonna start like I needed to start with something. That quality. picture might talk me into a lot of things. <laughs> yeah, I'll like, be honest. Uh, Topper Onion is just been out, and then they make like one of the best old fashions. Their bartenders are I think they're magicians. You know I don't know. <laughs> I still have never been there. Are you kidding? Okay, no. we gotta go. Oh Let's my gosh, go. you've never been. What is your very favorite <sighs> local restaurant if you had to pick a spot? Oh my gosh, don't do this to me. Probably Table X. <laughs> I know it. It's Table X, but I don't know if Hell's Backbone is considered local because it's four hours away, but it was. it's probably also Hell's. How do you describe that, though? Uh, you say that that's an experience. Yeah. You have to go down for the weekend. We go every fall. Um, that's a whole experience. Blake and Jen created magic down in Hell's Backbone. What's so, so great, though, is truly I end up at the same place at least every other weekend. And now, if you need best Korean barbecue, there it is. Best coffee shop, Penny Ann's for best breakfast, yeah. which we love Warren on the show. Oh, my gosh. I He's love so incredible. I love it. And I just feel like the City Weekly really nails it. And they, they really, and they let the readers pick. And so I feel like the readers know what they like. And I, I just. Let the people say. Yeah. yeah. And they like Good Things Utah. Best, <laughs> best Salt Lake Pizzeria, the pie. Right. Oh, my mouth just watered because yeah. I love the pie so much. And the, and you're and right. The, there's so many categories. I need pages and pages to put on the list for the new year. I feel like there's 400 categories. Honor <laughs> just to be nominated, but it's sure nice to win. <laughs> <laughs> it was the highlight. Of the year. Well, tonight, so more about City Weekly on our website, everybody. And Kat, thank you so thank much you for so your much. tips. We appreciate it.